White here from Four Guys Guns, and today we're talking about stealth gear. This is the new Flex outside the waistband holster from one of our favorite companies, Stealth Gear USA. You may have seen our Onyx inside the waistband holster review, which we really like because it's a combination of proven technology, which is a soft backer and a hard outer shell with newer breathable materials, and it really impressed us. Now, they've come out with the Flex. The Flex is their outside the waistband holster, and it's kind of neat because it utilizes a different strategy for basically mounting to the belt without too much of a deviation between J clips and plastic hooks and plastic loops, hand molded Kydex loops, um, injection molded, all that fun stuff. What they've done is they've taken these little wings that I like to call them, but you know, the flex wings themselves, and they've separated them off of the actual holster itself. So instead of it being one continuous piece of, you know, Kydex or soft material trying to wrap around a, a waistband, it actually lifts it off of the uh, material itself, giving it that little extra bit of give. Now, it's not like you need a suspension system for your holster or anything like that, but what this does is by extending that actual arm out and lifting it off, it allows it to flex in a different manner. So one of the things that I really, really liked about it was this actually holds it closer than any other outside the waistband holster I've ever tested. I would imagine, since I'm not an authority on things like operating operationally, but if I had to be plain clothes, if I was a police officer, detective, narcotics, things like that, and I wanted an outside the waistband holster that didn't have like that big bulkiness that stayed pretty concealed, this is a really good option. It's pretty darn secure on me. I can, we're not gonna try it, you know, hang it upside down. I'll probably break something, but this thing isn't coming out. I mean, I gotta give it a good solid tug to make sure it comes out properly and it, it does just that. The build construction is as expected from what we saw from the Onyx. All they've done is maybe change out from you know silver shiny fixture stuff to more of a subdued look. They've changed out some of the materials. So they did that without actually sacrificing the ruggedness of it all. What they've done is they've taken that same Cordura they use on the outside and they put it where your belt and all your material like jeans or your 5.11 pants or whatever you're wearing rubs on and that's gonna have a very, very high friction resistance. By doing that, they also kept the same kind of breathability to it. The part that may go up against your skin or up against your shirt still has that padding that we've come to love from the Onyx up in that sweat guard. So it's still gonna breathe. It's not gonna give you that nice little sticky, clammy grossness. The gun draw is smooth because the actual material is being used. There's a lot less marring than there is from other you know, outside the waistband, especially like leather that gets a lot more stuff kind of adhering and sticking to it. One of the things we did find since we have had this since the winter was in the colder temperatures, the elastomers got a little creaky if you had them a little too loose. So it's great because it gives you a little opportunity to say, hey, what's that creaking noise? And you start maintaining your hardware and checking it a little better, especially if you're carrying it every day. Another great feature is the actual belt loops are using themselves. They look like to be a nylon injected uh, system that has access through the backside for you to be able to adjust and tension your screws down, but it also accommodates everything from a two inch belt all the way down to a one five. They do it with this nice little kind of trapezoidal shape and they have your access holes right here in the back. So that way you can actually tension things down. You can also shift those belt loops. You'll see there's an extra hole right here, right? Yeah, right here. And what that does allows you to move those, those belt loops up and down any which way you like to actually raise it up higher or drop it down lower. All in all, a really great kind of twist on their design of what they did with the Onyx on the inside the waistband, and you have the Flex outside the waistband. Something that we don't have in our hands, but we have had our hands on that was also impressive was the magazine carrier that goes along this with. Really aggressive cant on the magazines. Um, we'll roll some footage from... Right, so like you saw in the giveaway, really aggressive cant on the mag carriers, which just, it just feeds right there and that's pretty cool, but all in all, Stealth Gear is a company that is really just coming really aggressively at the market right now, and I'm really curious to see how far they go because this is all really, really cool stuff and they're not afraid to take a chance. So if I was going out and about on town in the winter, in the fall, and I wanted outside the waistband, this is the go-to for sure. That's why I have it. Good retention, good concealment, especially at the four o'clock position. Check them out, stealthgearusa.com. This is the Flex. If you're looking for inside the waistband, Onyx. You can check out our review on that.
For outside the waistband, what's most important to you? Is it more concealment? Is it comfort? Is it speed of access? Just know that you can only pick two, you can't have three when it comes to holsters and concealment, period. Especially outside the waistband, things get a little bit trickier there. You stay safe, check your chambers, and we'll see you on the range. When I do that, in case you're wondering, jail to the will, bounce to the ounce. You didn't realize I knew there was a camera there, did you? Some sneaky, very sneaky, sir. People don't realize how hard it is sometimes to get that one take sweep back into the holster. It's because I'm that damn good. You actually have it lifted and separated off. <laughs> it lifts and separates. <laughs>